Any punches here will be calling blow. With that, are there any questions? Any questions for Chief Seconds? Remember, obey my commands, protect yourselves at all times. Touch them up now, good luck to both of you. That was against a relatively easy target. The left hook wobbles Castillejo early. Give in a quick little right hand, Jim. Castillejo has got to make certain that he keeps this a European type fight. Keep your hands up and don't go for any power shots. When a guy try to hit your back, stop it with your hands. Right hands, just good intentions, no power. Is here, Deloia with his left hand down around his waist. Castillejo with his left hand in front of his face. Good combination punching inside by Oscar Deloia. The tall, long, long guys. On paper, at least, Castillejo throws the jab more frequently than does Deloia. Castillejo landed a solid right hand side and over the top. Product of Oscar De La Hoya's left hand. Now Oscar's taking charge with his jab. Castillejo mixing things up a little bit. Jab it. Nothing gets out of hand. Castillejo short with his jab. De La Hoya able to step in and pop his to the face of Castillejo. Chopping right hand for the Spanish fighter. He has a plan. He has movement. Comes in, goes out, creating some problems for Oscar. That's what you want to do with Oscar. He's a puncher. Make him follow you around. Hard right hand by Deloria stuns Castillejo. But on his mark. For one shot. And that's when you can get him. Right hands from Deloria, something that he has often a solve a lot of punches. You take your time. Jab, go to the body. Not moving your head. You don't want to do that. Bounce around, get your foot in. Use it all. You're not going to do that counter punch in Europe like that. They just can wear you out with that stuff. And what Oscar does, he has this trainer, and he's shorter. Oscar Gore by habit. Coming from Delaware's punches, but that may simply be because he's missing so many of them. Yeah. And occasionally sticking in a right hand as he did there. Foot through three. Okay, Jim, three to nothing, 30 to 27. Oscar de la Hoya. In round three, he backed him straight up. Before 15,000 people all the time. Every fight's a big event for me. It's not going to bother me. It's not the way to do this, guy. You just got to let them go. Jab, right hand. Body shots well thrown by Del <laughs> To hold the arm out there. Another good flurry along the ropes. Around the fights when you throw punches. If you're a puncher, you're going to get tired. You got to live with that. Well, there's no question. He looked looser and more fluid than in his previous fights against Arturo Gatti earlier this year. And the pattern seems to repeat tonight. Most particularly the right hand. There's a good left hook that he landed inside. He can survive Delaware. He can defend his title. He can take after Delaware. Like that. You gotta show us more than that. Well, it may also be that he thinks that it's right uppercut, I thought. a right hand to the temple of Castillejo and firing a left hook right through the guard. Oscar doing a good job of holding his hands up, waiting those punches off. Stuff on the round, but we're going to show you in replay that good combination by Castillejo. Yeah, he... Castillejo, despite that good combination, only 5 out of 42. In favor of the American fighter. Some international experience fighting European fighter. Doing the Olympics. 300 amateur fights, George. Seen everything before he was ever a pro. <laughs> Greatest trainer in the world. Best trainer he's ever had. Learned more in the last six months than ever before. Well, I can, I can look at that from another way. I'm here and make his own changes, not just depend on one thing that has been lacking in Delaware before. Telling you things. 
So you see him staring away from me. Yeah. Right? It is his fifth trainer. Good body punch. Right to the body. De La Hoya defense right there. Parrying shots with his right hand. And he gets rocked with a left hook. And comes back with power punches of his own. Oscar boxing, punching aggressively. Pastry named Bredahl and a French fry, certainly more than something just to munch on. Back on the ropes and backing up. Oscar De La Hoya just taking it to it, just to see now. One. Well, George Larry makes the point that feel that Castiedo can, can hurt him. Also for defense, and you gotta make sure that you don't move your hand up and down like right where they are. If you move them, you can get shot. He's not just there, he just doesn't know exactly what to do yet. Yeah, it's soon. He can kick things up a little bit, Castejo. Out of there in the last 30 seconds of the seventh round. Some drama. There you go again. He's dropping the right hand and not keeping the left it with the left hook. Archie Moore said that you got to keep it there. Don't move it around. In this round, in the seventh round, by copy of box numbers. So has Moore's got him. Why he's holding back on it, I'd like to know. Oscar's not jabbing much. Blood. You get tired. Blood from the champion's nose. That would be Castillejo. Remember, it is Castillejo's title bloodying the Spanish champion's nose here in round eight. That is all night for him. Wow. Red trunks of Delaware had out of door. He's got to come after power that he hasn't seen before. It's enough to make you back a win. But you got to make him fan that thing. Hale is thinking, hey, this guy's gonna run out of power sooner or later, and it doesn't happen round after round. The lightning that he used to carry. To your left, constantly, Oscar comes a sucker for a right hand. He drops it, put his left hand on his hip. Landed it, just as you said, this with one. And Delaware rips him with a left hook. Trinidad does that, and he waits and chop you on top of it. Delaware with a big left hook upstairs to take it but backing away over and over and over and Castillejo changing nothing so far in resignation you see late in a fight when the fighter starts to believe he can't believe he's gonna win anymore is on his face yes when you alert and you have your everything about you and you just sit there the footwork of Oscar. That's what I'd like to see. Go ahead. Not even Mosley. Good body shots by De Loya. <laughs> Barring the sudden arrival of a judge from Spain, it's... So let's see if the Spanish titleist wants to save his championship with a desperation rally. Coming alive. Castillejo. Oscar's using that fan mill, using his right hand like a fan. Crossover. You gotta keep it there. Well, I think one thing we've learned from the last minute or so of action still doesn't have the power to hurt De La Hoya in those exchanges. Lightweight. Straight right hand for De La Hoya. Ripped Castillejo back. Yeah, the punches sound better at 154, George. But the things are slow. Wreck that that crossover if you're gonna use it. Defense, but you better use it properly. Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. They'd love to see a late round knockout. Close the show out. This is not the Delaware. <laughs> and you heard Mayweather telling Oscar, if you get him into a situation where you can unload and keep throwing until the referee stops the fight. But if you get into that situation. Good left hook by Castillo.
Looks like they will go to the 12th. The punch is there, the footwork is there. Maybe it's just disappointment that he hasn't been able to put fight and that it will go 12 rounds. And there will be bigger punches, quicker fighters. What will Oscar bring to that? He has shown skill, but he's in all probability going to leave here with... Man, out of you also. Big guy world now. He's got to finish strong now. He's got the power. Castillejo down in the closing seconds of the fight. It was about like his trainer said, one after another shot is going to do it. Right, left, right, and down went Castillejo. Just keep throwing and something is going to happen. All for the winner by unanimous decision, now a six-time world champion and new WBC Super World.